The floodlights are beaming down on the players here at Stamford Bridge in West London. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And Chelsea hold the advantage going into the second leg of this UEFA Champions League semi-final tie. It is Chelsea facing Porter. Yeah, thanks Derek. You probably have to say Chelsea just edged that first leg. I thought they played really, really well. But if they concede an early goal, could be very, very interesting this game. Number 17, Mateo Kovacic. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. And Goro Conte starts alongside Matteo Kovacic in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Olivier Giroud. Thank you, Stamford. Well, here's the starting 11 Thank for Porto. It looks pretty orthodox, Lee. Yeah, I love this formation, 4-4-2. The two main strikers will stay close together. The full-backs will link up with the wide players. The two holding midfields will sit in front of the centre-backs. Very solid look about this team. Aspili Cueta. Thiago Silva. On the ball, Aspili Quetta. Conte. James. Conte now. It's with Giroud. Aspili Quetta. Rhys James. And successfully cut out. And a throw-in forthcoming. <laughs> Rhys James. Now the attack promising as it was. Scuppered there. Well, can they be creative from here? Options in the middle. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Jesus Corona. Losing possession a bit easily. N'Golo Conte. Conte. Here's Kovacic. Conte. And he did well to cut it out. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Rudiger. Mateo Kovacic. Conte now. Here's Kovacic. Giroud. Thiago Silva. 
Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Giroud. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Might it be Olivier Giroud. And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. But most of the blame has to be levelled at the goalkeeper. You're coached as a youngster to always protect your near post, and he just didn't do that and paid the price. Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room, if it stays like this, Derek, he's not happy. Just look at him. You just feel it might be getting away from them. 3 0 on aggregate. Number 18, Olivier Giroud. Marega. Mateo Suribe. And on the ball, Sergio Oliveira. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Giroud. And Mount. And Goro Conte. Well, possibilities inside the box. Werner. It could be. He's gone and found the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging for someone to get on the end of it. And then the brute force and guile in equal amounts sets up the chance to score. And he doesn't disappoint, does he? And the aggregate score has a one-sided look about it. 4-0. Number 18, Olivier Giroud. N'Golo Conte. Aspili Quetta. Moving the ball effectively. Mateo Kovacic and Goro Conte. Strong but fair tackle. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Oh, lovely ball. Jesus Corona. And you need your defender to take charge. Corner kick played in. Competent goalkeeping. Yeah, right place at the right time. Foils the attacker. And firing it into the area. Gets his glove on it. Well thumped clear. Oliveira. Mehdi Karami. And unable to keep the ball. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Conte. Aspili Quetta. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Ngoro Conte. Conte. Werner. 
Oh, good hit. Close shave. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Sergio Oliveira. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Conte couldn't hang on to it. Wilson Manafa, Mateo Suribe, Taremi. Oh, nice ball. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, the attack promising as it was scuppered there over the touchline for a throw in Mbemba Thiago Silva on to Werner. Mateo Kovacic. James. And Mount. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Mount. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Mateo Kovacic. Kovacic. And so the first half draws to a close here in West London.
And they're underway in the second half of this Champions League semi-final second leg. And fine work from Chelsea to win the ball back. Olivier Giroud. James. Porto have given us away. Reese James. And Chelsea have given us away. Ottavio. Uribe. Moving it forward. Mateo Kovacic. N'Golo Conte. Can he play it in? Rhys James. Conte. And moving the ball nicely. Mateo Kovacic. Conte. Here's Kovacic. Werner. Giroud. Timo Werner. In it goes. A three-goal cushion. This is astonishing stuff. And here it is again. It's a great team passing move to set up the chance. And once he gets himself settled with the keeper to beat, he hammers it into the back of the net. Smashing goal. Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room. If it stays like this, Derek, he's not happy. Just look at him. Difficult to land punches when there's this sort of golf in quality. 5-0 the aggregate score. Pepe. Taremi. Marega. A oh, tremendous block. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. And he puts it away confidently. Well, here's a replay as a penalty taker myself for many a year. I used to love this part when it hits the back of the net. Not so great when you miss one, though. So a personnel change then. So just to confirm the aggregate scoreline of this tie, 5-1 it is. Tammy Abraham. Rudiger. Here's Kovacic. And a throw-in forthcoming. So making the substitution now.
Wilson Manafa. Here's Grujic. Marega. Jesus Corona. Wilson Manafa. And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready and now they will make the personnel change. Pepe. They've given it away. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. Ziyech. On to Abraham. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Aspiliqueta. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Tammy Abraham dangerous looking through ball getting forward Mount he knows what he's doing when it comes to blocking so a throw in to Chelsea time for a change then Reese James and a chance to whip it in here. James. He's enjoying space. In search of space. He cuts it back. And able to get a body in the way. In position here to protect the ball. A really intense pressure applied. Ziesch. Now the task is to remain focused. And there it is! Three goals in front now! An immense performance! Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room if it stays like this, Derek, he's not happy. Just look at him. So the aggregate score now, 6-1 here. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Rudiger. Marcos Alonso. Ziesch. Abraham. Tammy Abraham. Mehdi Karami using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball just straying offside Chelsea have it back now. Tammy Abraham. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And the decision is one of offside here.
Grujic. Marega. Marega. Gives it a go. Alas, a wild, wild attempt. Well, after that effort, I'm not sure whether he's right or left footed. And he saw the situation developing. Ziesch. Werner. Marcus Alonso. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Conte. Dangerous looking attack. James. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. And well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Porto have given it away. There goes the final whistle. Let the celebrations begin. They are through to the Champions League final. Well, because of what's at stake, i.e. a final, semi-finals can be a bit nervy at times. Not the case this time, the semi-final was a breeze. An easy march to that big game. Can't wait for the final, to be honest with you. Let's wait and see whether they can produce what they did in the semis.